Good evening, my fellow human beings, or the whatever the time zone is, or my friends. Thank you very much for being here. I have here um, a reading about the what is the standpoint of the divine feminine. So I've pulled out sixteen cards, uh, no, eighteen cards, and I can read the following. The Empress, here, the Empress has come full cycle. Okay. And she's giving birth to the High Priestess. She has solved uh, childhood wounds. Okay, and she uh, has joy in her life. Okay, she ha she's united. She's in secret union with herself, the inner child and the wounded child are happy and together. Here. With the stars, she's connected to source, right? She's in love with herself. She's in the momentum. Okay. She is in secret union with herself. Okay. The universe has her back. That's what I read. Okay. Um, she's ready and she's searching and she's uh, not searching she's attracting with her magnetism and she has one two three four five she has five offers okay she has five offers from the emperor from the King of Cups, from the Emperor, uh, sorry. from the Knight of Cups, and the Knight of Pentacles, and the Page of Pentacles, and the Page of Wands, so six offers. But because she's negotiating from a, a position of power, like Jordan Peter says, that women only made equally or above she's waiting for the magician because she's going to become the 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 high priestess so she's being patiently waiting okay she's using her magnetism to wait for the right offer okay and this is what i call negotiation from a position of power i will leave the links down below of all concepts that I've talked about, they are sources on the respective videos, okay? So, thank you. Um, I'm going to pull another card from this one. To give a message to the Divine Feminine and the Divine Masculine, okay? That's what the source wants to tell us. Trust the Nigel. What is the niggling feeling trying to tell you? Okay, listen to your listen to your gut and align your life. Okay? Align your life. Let's pull another card. Anna, grandmother of Jesus, seeding the light, laying foundations, divine pine. So the only thing we need to do right now is to work on ourselves. So the divine feminine and the divine masculine have to work on, on themselves. And the best they resonate, the best they are aligned with their frequencies, the better. Okay? So thank you very much for being here with me. Comment, like, subscribe, hit the bell button. And for donations, there is the link down below. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Bye.